Hey everyone, this is Greg with the Investigators Report and I'm doing another video interview with Dr. Beth Lay. She's an author of over 30 different health books, uh, but the one that we're going to be talking about today is her book on MSM. She calls it the Forgotten Nutrient, On Our Way Back to Health with Sulfur. Uh, Beth, it's a pleasure having you back on the program with me. Hi Greg, happy to be here. Thank you. So anyway, we did a really good interview a few weeks back uh, talking about all the different topics that you get into in the book. Uh, but there's some new research that uh, came out not too long ago that uh, is really pretty mind-blowing on MSM. And so uh, I wanted to uh, get into that specifically on this particular interview. So what can you tell us about this, uh, this USNIH study that's up there on sulfur? Well, you know, it's, it's very exciting. Um, you know, with a, a science background, I um, absolutely love research. I love that when I make a claim about, uh, you know, something like MSM, that I can back it up with research. And uh, the research has been done. And, um, you know, with really exciting and uh, even surprising results, um, you know, showing um, you know, why MSM is so effective, um, you know, in so many uh, of the uh, areas of the body that, you know, we've, we've known uh, those of us who use uh, MSM faithfully, you know, we've known this, but, you know, now we have research to, you know, support it and then show us the why of how it works. Um, there's also some research that, um, you know, that I was totally unaware of. You know, the, uh, the anti-cancer benefits are very exciting and surprising to me. And so, you know, we're going to talk about that. But, um, you know, the, the, the benefits, the research, I mean, it's, it's very exciting to me. Let's get into this actual story here because this, this goes through, gosh, let me see, one, two, three. It says, uh, I mean, I'll just touch on it and then you can discuss it more. Description and history of MSM. The sulfur cycle, I don't want to really get into that. It talks about bioavailability, but yeah, uh, anti specifically, yeah, yeah. anti-inflammation, <laughs> anti antioxidant, yeah. uh, immune modulation, uh, sulfur donor methylation, arthritis and inflammation, cartilage preservation, uh, improved range of motion and physical function, uh, reduce muscle soreness associated with exercise, reduce oxidative stress, uh, improve seasonal allergies, improve skin quality and texture, MSM and cancer. Gosh, we could spend a, a couple hours talking about every one of these different topics, but um, what? I mean, get, get into some of this, Beth. This is, this well, is really hard it, to believe that the well, NIH actually has a cell. Yep, under anti-inflammatory, um, it shows that MSM reduces um, the interleukin-6 and the tumor necrosis factor and so, um, you know, it's what happens with inflammation is these things increase and actually damage the tissue, specifically the cartilage tissue. So not only does it, when you have something that's anti-inflammatory and you reduce these things, the, like I said, the interleukin-6 and the tumor necrosis factor, um, so therefore it becomes, um, reduces pain. So, um, you know, that's, a, that's one of the huge benefits that we've seen with MSM is it reduces arthritis pain, um, but it also reduces, you know, inflammation in other areas, such as the lungs um, and other areas, uh, which we'll get into. Um, but in the case of arthritis, I think um, it's this protective factor against the tissue damage where it actually shows, shown it preserves the cartilage tissue and, you know, this is so huge because arthritis um, is a condition that gets worse as we age. And the more that that tissue breaks down, you know, the more pain and the more, um, you know, problems that people have with arthritis. Um, so this is just a huge, huge uh, benefit, um, not to mention the fact that it's uh, antioxidant. And that is another uh, Re way that the body uh, suffers is the anti the uh, free radicals produced in inflammation also damage the tissue. So I mean this is very exciting. This is a uh, you know anti aging. 
This does not just apply to arthritis, but it applies to all the connective tissue in the body. Um, you know, I hopefully they'll have more research coming out on the benefits of skin, such as, you know, wrinkling. Um, but, you know, the research here is just, uh, it's just absolutely exciting. Um, so we talked about the cartilage preservation protection. Um, we talked about it as a, they've shown that it has free radical scavenging ability as an antioxidant. They've shown it's an anti-inflammatory and they've shown how it, it uh, reduces inflammation. And then, like I said, therefore, uh, reduces pain. Um, they talked about the dosages. Um, four grams was kind of a, uh, as a standard minimum that they used. Some of the other studies used up to nine grams a day, and they've shown that these are all safe dosages. Um, so anywhere from four to nine grams was the uh, daily, was the uh, acceptable dosages. Um, and then the antioxidant, or the, I'm sorry, antihistamine, um, you know, I've known that, uh, uh, MSM is very beneficial for things like um, allergies and sinusitis. Um, and even in a situation of like, if I get a cold, I will always increase my, my MSM. And um, it, now we know that it is a truly a, a natural antihistamine. And it doesn't have the side effects that drug antihistamines have. So, you know, in, uh, seasonal allergies, you know, regular allergies, in the case of even someone with, that had hives, um, I would strongly uh, recommend an increase in MSM dosage um, or any type of other, um, you know, histamine reaction that, uh, you know, people can get, um, any type of allergic reaction. Hi, um, Beth, let's get into the whole issue with with cancer, what what's so uh, shocking with this article about MSM and cancer? Um, you know, well, it's basically showing that you know MSM is anti-cancer, um, and it's showing that it's actually able to um, you know to kill um, you know the, the the cancer cells, of course, without damaging the other healthy cells which is, you know, the problem with the, you know, the current medical treatments, chemotherapy and radiation, you know, you're at huge risk of damaging healthy tissue. And uh, with MSM, obviously, we don't have that problem. Um, so they're calling it tumor growth suppression ability. Um, and the types of cancer that they've shown this um, to be effective for include prostate cancer, breast cancer, esophageal, stomach, colon, and liver cancer. So, of, of course, this is just very exciting research for people who, um, you know, either want to use MSM in conjunction with their medical treatment or they want to go the completely alternative route. You know, this is something that I would now, you know, strongly encourage, um, you know, addition into, you know, there's uh, you know, other things that I would recommend. We're not saying this is a cure, but this is absolutely very exciting research. I, for it to be on the USNIH site, I know anybody in the medical profession, unless they see something that has research behind its studies, they usually think that uh, people in the supplement industry are just out there trying to trying to push a product and uh, that has no science behind it. So this really, in my opinion... Okay. Adds these a ton are, of credibility. Yes, these are double blind clinical trials. And, you know, of course, they don't start with humans. They usually start with mice. Um, they usually do, you know, cell studies and then they move on to animal studies. They also did studies on dogs and they've also done studies on humans. So, um, you know, this is reputable research. And this is many, many studies. If you look on the right of the screen, you can see all the different studies, um, you know, over the years that have been reviewed to, you know, for the authors to put together this report of all the benefits. So we're not just talking about a handful of studies. We're talking about many, many studies over, over many years over all the, you know, and over the whole world. This is not just a handful of studies. Hmm. Wow.
Okay, so um, there is so much there in that article. And, you know, I, I've seen these results from MSM just myself, Beth. Uh, allergies, I think I mentioned that in one of the other interviews I did with you. I used to suffer with terrible allergies. I mean, literally. And I, I have a dog, and, and so I do have sensitivity to pets. But literally for years, I would wake up in the morning, and as soon as my feet would hit the ground, I'd start sneezing and blowing my nose, and it wouldn't stop. And uh, I've tried everything, natural stuff, natural herbs, you name it. The only thing that ever used to alleviate it, but it was just temporary, was, was ephedra when it was on the market back before the FDA banned it. And uh, it used to at least clear me up. But um, I started taking MSM probably seven years ago when we first started selling it, or eight years ago. And I'm telling you, within two or three days, they were gone. I mean, barely at all. I never have issues with allergies at all anymore. So that, from my standpoint, made a huge difference. Also, this article talked about um, exercise and, and recovery. And that's yeah. another big thing that I've noticed with the uh, MSM. When I go to the gym, I can, I can do some incredible workouts. I mean, I'm 49 years old. I can out-train most of the young people that are in the gym, I, and people must look at me and think I'm crazy when I'm in there because I'm, I don't really take any breaks. I roll from equipment to equipment. I'm literally dripping sweat after an hour of being in the gym, and uh, I rarely ever get sore. And I know that that a big part of that is the MSM. So what what kind of experience do you see with this in your clinic? I know this is a big protocol for your patients, isn't it? Well, I think that the most common um, use for it is for arthritis, osteoarthritis, um, and even rheumatoid arthritis. Um, and it, you know, it does work quickly. You know, people can see results in a matter of, you know, just a few days, um, especially if they're taking, you know, the higher doses that I recommend. Um, the, the, the research that we looked at did say that the benefits are dose dependent, meaning the more that you take, the faster you will get the benefits and the more benefits that you will have. Um, um, but certainly it was nice to see, um, you know, an explanation for the muscle pain, um, you know, that that is, that's also been, you know, documented now in the research that it's excellent for athletes. Um, anyone who jogs, walks, you know, any, any type of uh, weightlifting, um, that it's going to be protecting those muscles. It says from the, you know, the, um, there's tiny little tears that happen, you know, with exercise and it's basically protecting the tissues, you know, which is, you know, very exciting. And I think that's also why it's beneficial, um, at, in, in, uh, topical products like lotions for the skin. You'll find it in anti-aging creams and things like that. Um, so I, I definitely would like to see more research on that. I did see that skin cancer was mentioned in the, um, and rosacea were mentioned in the, um, in the section about skin quality, texture, et cetera. And, um, and definitely the allergies. You know, I think those are the main areas that people um, are getting a lot of benefit from MSM. So they say MSM doesn't store in your body like some different minerals and, and supplements, but that you have to take it twice a day because it, uh, you really need to keep replenishing it. What do, you know, what do you know about that? And do you take it like that twice a day? I take it twice a day unless I'm taking um, more than four grams at a time. Um, I don't recommend more than four grams at a time because it's highly water soluble. And if you were to take more than that, it's probably not going to, it's probably a lot of it will be washed out. Um, so if you're going to be taking, you know, so I, I usually start people at three to four grams AM and PM. If you need more than that, I would go to three to four grams three times a day. And several of the research studies that were done. Um, you know, one of the osteoarthritis studies, they used three grams three times a day. And, you know, they got excellent results. And it's simply because it's very water soluble. Hmm. Interesting. So 
you do patient consultations, correct? Absolutely. By All phone right. and by email. Okay. So if somebody wanted to talk to you more, uh, give out your contact information so anybody watching this video could uh, contact you for further information. Okay. The website is recipes for life with Dr. Beth. Dot com and they would simply click on nutrition counseling and you can uh, sign up right on the on the uh, website um, you can get the forms that need to be downloaded that uh, one needs to fill out um, or they can simply call me at 218-363-6719 or email me at b l e y at b l publications.com and they can get more information on pricing and uh, you know how the how it works. Also, give a plug for your book, MSM, and any of your other books. They're all available on Amazon, correct? Yep, Amazon.com. There's also a a, a Kindle um, uh, edition available on Amazon.com. You can get the hard copy at, uh, of course, a lot of health food stores, but all you can get it at Greg's website. Um, my website, which I just mentioned, the recipes for life with drbeth.com. Um, I do have, I'm sure, 30 or more different books that I've written, um, you know, starting in the late 80s, you know, when I became um, interested in, in uh, natural health. And, um, um, you know, hmm. there's uh, lots to look at on the website. Yeah. So, all right. We do have your book available and I'm going to be doing more interviews. Hopefully we can touch on all the different books that you've written. So that's good. And uh, for anybody that's interested in actually purchasing sulfur defense from seven lights, you can go to our website. It should be shown here, sevenlightshealth.com. And uh, it's under the bestseller section, sulfur defense. We have a number of different options available, but the best version is simply the one pound canister of crystals, or you can purchase it on Amazon. We do have it. It's a great seller up on Amazon as well. Uh, just put in sulfur defense from seven lights and you'll get it up there. If you're a prime member, you can get it usually in the next, in the next day with free shipping. But if you go to our site, you can check it out. It should be scrolling through the video here as you're looking at it. Um, this is my best selling product and I'm sure you've seen it with your patients as well, Beth, the feedback, the testimonials, it's unlike anything that I've ever dealt with before in the industry. And I've been involved with a lot of different products, but to, to hear the reports back from people that say, man, my joints feel better. I, uh, my allergies um, in my hip is better. This is better. They, people just notice a huge difference. Their skin feels better. You actually get a, a healthy uh, facial complexion and almost like a shine to your skin after you're on it for about a week. I don't know if you've noticed that as well. Yep. Yeah, I think it has to do with, um, you know, not only the support for the, uh, you know, the collagen, the connective tissue, but it's also a detox nutrient. And a lot of skin problems, um, you know, people have flat skin because they're, you know, the skin is an organ of detox. And so people can have just sort of flat, dull looking skin because they're holding on to toxins in their skin and MSM simply helps move them out. So yeah. Um, just so many benefits. You know, we could talk about this for hours, <laughs> but, uh, you know, we'll just save that for another time. Okay. Well, Beth, I certainly appreciate you being on the, uh, on the show with me today. Thanks for your time.